Hey guys, it's Sarah and welcome back to my channel. Today's deal comes to you from Walmart. And once again, we have some amazing deals going on at Walmart using different rebate apps like Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, and Shopkick to name a few. If you're new to my channel, thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate you and I appreciate all of you who are return visitors to my channel as well. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. When I hit 1,000 subscribers, I am doing a giveaway and you will have to be a subscriber in order to enter. So be sure to hit that button and hit the like button if you like seeing Walmart Ibotta hauls. As always, I will leave links in the description box to a printable breakdown that you can either print to take with you in the store or you can pull up on your Google Docs app on your phone. And I will also leave links to Ibotta, Fetch Rewards, Shopkick, and a lot of other rebate apps so that you guys can maximize your savings. So I was working with a bonus on Ibotta that gave me $5 back when I redeemed 18 offers. I needed 12 offers to complete that bonus and I did hit exactly 12 in this haul. So let's jump right into the deals. An easy rebate that hopefully you have on your Ibotta account is on this Powerade Ultra. It's 20 ounces and it's only $1 at Walmart. You will pay that out of pocket, but then Ibotta will give you 40 cents back, making your final cost just 60 cents. And as always, check your Ibotta accounts because accounts do vary. I also had a rebate on this Skippy squeezable peanut butter. So it's priced at $2.47. You will pay that out of pocket, but then Ibotta will give you $2.47 back, making your final cost completely free. We have some fantastic razor deals at Walmart this week. The Skin to Mint Bloom Razor is $7.97. I used a $4 printable from coupons.com, and then Ibotta gave me $3 back, making my final cost just $0.97. Cents. We have a similar deal on the razor refills. So the skin to mitt razor refills are also $7.97. I also used a $4 printable from coupons.com on this. Ibotta gave me $3 back, making my final cost just 97 cents. Now this coupon gave me a little bit of an issue. The cashier did put it through for me, but just a heads up on that. The poise pads are $4.68. I grabbed the, actually the liners, not the pads. And this is the 44 count package of liners and they are very light, long length. So the coupons and rebates sometimes have exclusion. So you have to be very careful with that. These did qualify for my coupon and rebates. So these were $4.68. I used a $2 poise printable from coupons.com. Fetch Rewards gave me 2,000 points, which is equivalent to $2, and then Ibotta gave me 50 cents back, making my final cost just 18 cents. And same with the You Buy Kotex. There are exclusions on the rebates and coupons, so just pay attention and read carefully. This is the 40 count box. It's the Light Days Plus Absorbent Liners, and these are only $2.97 at my store. I used a dollar printable from coupons.com. If you don't have that, the coupons app does have this coupon available. Fetch Rewards gave me 2,000 points, which is equivalent to $2. And then Ibotta gave me 50 cents, making my final cost completely free plus a 53 cent moneymaker. And another razor deal you can do is on the Skin to Mint Disposable Razors. So this is Raspberry Rain and it's a four count container of razors. It's $5.97. I used a $3 printable from coupons.com and then Ibotta gave me $2 back, making my final cost just 97 cents. So the M&M candy bars, there was a Shopkick deal on this. Now I've redeemed it so many times that I couldn't redeem it again. I could get my scan kicks, but not my buy kicks. So look and see if you have a deal on your Shopkick app for this. But I grabbed one of these at $1.68. 
because the coupons app is giving us $2 back when we spend $10 on this item. And I was only like $1.40 away from that. So this was $1.68. I got my $2 back from the coupons app. And then Shopkick gave me 12 cents for my scan kicks, making my final cost completely free plus a 44 cent money maker. Some more Shopkick deals that we have are on these Super Danimals smoothies. So we have separate rebates, one for the blueberry and one for the strawberry. So these are each priced at $2.98. Shopkick is giving us $2.70 for buying each of these. So our final cost for each ends up being just $0.28 which is an amazing deal for some smoothies. A fantastic money maker you can do is on these Malta Meal cereal bags. I had looked for these the last time I was at Walmart and couldn't find them and this time there was a huge display and it wasn't in the cereal aisle but it was close to it. It was out in the middle aisle so just look around in your food section see if you can find these but they do say try me on top. So the try me variety bags are only $1. Shopkick has a deal giving us $5.20 back when we buy one of any variety. And then the other has to be either the Berry Colossal Crunch or there's another variety that you can grab. So check your Shopkick app and make sure you're grabbing the right ones. My scan kicks didn't work on these items, but Shopkick is always great at giving us our kicks back if we buy our qualifying items. And it doesn't have any size exclusions on the rebate, so these should qualify. So getting that $5.20 back from Shopkick, these end up being completely free plus a $3.20 money maker, which is unbelievable. A super easy rebate you can grab is on the Kraft Mac and Cheese. So these are only 98 cents. I bought us giving us 20 cents back, making our final cost just 78 cents. Thank you so much to Couponing with Kayla for this deal. This is an awesome rebate, super easy. So if you're tracking toward a bonus, this is a great one to grab. The little single Kool-Aid packets are only 24 cents. Ibotta is giving us 10 cents back on any brand drink mix, making our final cost just 14 cents. And I've never tried this Sharkleberry Finn. I'm really intrigued by that flavor. So I'm excited to give that a try. Another easy deal you can do is on the Snickers bars. So the single bars that are 1.86 ounces are only 88 cents at Walmart. Ibotta is giving us 50 cents back, making our final cost just 38 cents. Now I have watched some other YouTubers and I've noticed that some people have a rebate that says that you have to buy two to get 50 cents back. So again, pay attention to your Ibotta account to see what it says. Mine said that I only had to buy one, which was an amazing deal. The Jergens 10 ounce lotion, they have different scents. This is the original scent. It says cherry almond. These are only $3.48. I used a $1.50 printable from coupons.com and Ibotta gave me a dollar back, making my final cost for this 10 ounce lotion just 98 cents. And I did find a few things in my clearance section. So I found another of the Clairol Root Touch-Ups for $2. I've been stocking up on these for my sister and it seems like almost every time I go to Walmart, I find one. So these are only $2 and I always check on the Walmart app. I open up my Walmart app and use the barcode scanner to make sure that it's actually going to ring up for $2. And the coupons app, has a coupon giving us $2 back, making this item completely free. There's also a $5 off of two Clairol hair collar coupon on the coupons app. 
So if I was able to find another one for $2, I could have made a dollar off of buying both, but I could only find one this time, which is okay. Free is still free, but you guys might wanna be on the lookout for that if you have a lot of hair collar in your Walmart clearance section. And another amazing find that I grabbed was this waterless hair balm. I've never tried this, but I do have thick and coily hair, so I'm super excited to try this. It said $5 on it, but when I scanned it on the Walmart app, these are actually ringing up at $1.50, you guys. So I was very fortunate to find two of them because we have a $3 off of two coupon in the March P&G insert on any waterless item. So I grabbed two of them for $3. I used that $3 off of two coupon, making these completely free. So I think that's everything. Let me share with you guys my receipt and then we'll go over my totals. And all the coupons worked well, except for this coupon gave me some weird message saying that I had to have approval and then the you buy kotex actually it didn't want to take a dollar off so that had to be manually put in as well but i read and reread the restrictions this item did match as far as i could tell so i'm not sure why it gave me issues but just a heads up on that and for those of you who have been following my channel i did use self-checkout it was the only thing open when i went there were no cash registers open besides self-checkout and I had that same cashier at self-checkout that's been giving me issues with getting free items and using my coupons. And so when I called him over to put these two in, he put them in without any problems, you guys. It was amazing. So I think he's gotten the message that I know the coupon policy at Walmart and he can't pull anything over on me. So everything else rang up smoothly and that's where he manually put in the dollar for the you buy kotex and then one of these it just said it needed approval for the razors and so he approved it so my subtotal was 34.75 for 19 items and that was after coupons so before coupons my total value was 53 dollars and 25 cents and that was actually, I didn't take into consideration that these were on clearance. So I actually grabbed about $60 worth of items here. Ibotta gave me $18.77 back. That does include my $5 bonus. Uh, the coupons app gave me $4 back. Fetch gave me $4.05 back. Shopkick gave me or should give me $10.76 back. To be honest, I haven't gotten my money back yet from Shopkick. They're always really great though about if you submit a ticket. If you don't get all of your points back, be sure to submit a ticket and they will honor that. So my final cost for everything ended up being completely free plus a $2.83 money maker. Super excited guys. Always excited to get everything for free and to make some money at Walmart. If you guys have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I hope you guys are finding some amazing deals this week, and hopefully I will be back very soon with some other deals for you guys. And until next time, happy couponing.